Uh, amidst the focus on diversity in the tech sector, also calls to make artificial intelligence more reliable and sustainable, especially when it comes to ensuring that AI systems consume less energy. These are some areas experts say need to be addressed. Research and training in these areas could be boosted through government plans, announced last week. Marcus Tan tells us more. Meet the man with a plan to get more people well-versed in AI. Associate Professor Brian Lowe is the main brain behind the recently launched Accelerated Master's program in AI. What makes the program unusual is it is open to Singaporean university students before they even graduate. So our aim here is really to be able to nurture and groom and expose uh, the local Singaporean undergraduates to research early. This is where our accelerated master's program is uniquely different from that you, uh, those that you see outside. Now we will be providing a form of scholarship to the undergraduates in the last year of their study. F following that will be the first year of their master's. The program will be heavily focused on research. Some problems that he says need solving are making AI technology use less energy and computing power and producing more reliable results. Areas in which overseas researchers like assistant professor Ko Pang Wei are known for. He's researched and worked at the labs of Stanford and Google. As a Singaporean, he's keen to be part of another new government plan to bring in visiting AI professors to collaborate and share their expertise. AI is just so rapidly developing. There's lots of ideas, lots of new developments happening elsewhere. Um, and just to be being able to tap into these together, have an exchange of people. We send students over, we bring students uh, to Singapore, we bring faculty to Singapore, send faculty overseas. Uh, I think that really helps to sort of cement Singapore as a node it's an important note in the global AI ecosystem, and that's crucial if we want to you know, be a leader in AI. The extra minds won't just help with technological advancements. Some say it will also help manage the tough ethical issues related to AI, including the use of data in AI systems, as well as how AI is governed. With uh, many of these uh, uh, large language models and all, um, students are beginning to ask uh, deeper questions, more ethical questions about the use of AI and um, how you know, that's going to play a role uh, or how it's going to affect the society as a whole, not just you know, in terms of their work, but also in terms of their life and you know, society uh, is going to benefit from this. Indeed, some students are already identifying new issues surrounding AI. When we uh, collaborate with more people, uh, especially, especially those from different cultures, different backgrounds. I think that's when we can find the best solutions that work in different cases. You know, in AI, we always have this thing of generalizability. How well can your solution train on your problem kind of work in other scenarios? One thing is clear, AI brings both new opportunities and obstacles. And these students and researchers are eager to be a part of it all.